Fort Wayne's contract with Green for Life Environmental starts this Friday, and the company says mist collections will be a thing of the past. But there will be some other changes you need to know about. Our team coverage continues with Fox 55's Brianna Bias. She spoke to representatives from GFL and the city this morning and tells us what those changes are and how they'll affect your wallet. The city of Fort Wayne is finally saying good riddance to Red River Waste Solutions and hello to Green for Life. Help is on the way. Council President Jason Arp says GFL's contract will officially be a go on Friday. And even though the company driving through your neighborhood will be new, your pickup schedule will stay the same. Now, one thing that will change is that starting Friday, residents will have a limit of just three extra plastic garbage bags that they can leave outside the can. Any more than that, and they'll have to start paying for an additional can. In the past, I think we've had requests for unlimited pickup. We have had instances in which people have just left trash outside the bag while the cart was half empty. Public Works Director Sean Gunawardena says one of the most important things people can do to help the company stay on schedule is to not delay them with a lot of loose trash. They stop in front of a property no more than 15 seconds, right? But if the driver has to get down and pick stuff up, then it takes a lot longer. It slows them down. And also there's a lot more wear and tear on your body as well. But Jacob Diliberto with GFL isn't concerned about his team falling behind. I'm 110% staff, so I've got 10% more people in every line of business across uh, every type of vehicle. But for residents who are excited about no longer having missed pickups, ARP has one piece of bad news. Expect an upcharge. You're probably going to pay 50% more for trash collection. But that's that's going to be an iterative process and raising the rates. We're not going to just dump it all on people immediately. He says they'll increase the price a little each year until the end of GFL's contract. But for now, he hopes that people will just rejoice with him at the fact that their waste is getting picked up on time and wave to collectors when they drive by. In Fort Wayne, I'm Brianna Bias, Fox 55 News. And even though your trash pickup schedule will stay the same, the week of the 4th of July will be different because GFL isn't working that holiday. They'll be one day behind that week, but they say they'll get back on track afterward.